the product we're introducing is an Olin's mechatronic shock for the Kawasaki ZX10. And so what this does, you, you just you mount the shock on your bike, you plug in the Olin's ECU to the CAN bus cable that comes off of the motorcycle's ECU, plug the shock into that, and there it goes. Whatever the motorcycle knows about how you are riding the bike, our shock knows about what you're doing. What this shock does is it's active. No matter where you have this motorcycle set, on low, medium, or high, this shock is constantly reading what the rider is doing and constantly making changes so that it's being so that it's tuned properly. So so whatever you're doing, um, the the shock itself has has two modes. It has a uh, a comfort and a sport mode, and both of those modes work in all three of the motorcycles modes. What the difference is is how quickly they might trans uh, change from comfort up to sport. If, if you have the bike set on the low mode, then there has to be a higher threshold of active riding for it to become more sporty. If you have the bike set on the high mode, then that threshold is lower. And not only then will it become more sporty, but then a, a, again, everything you're doing, your braking going into a turn, the rear shock is making adjustments so that the bike is, is better set up for what you're doing. You're going through the turn, the shock is making adjustments. You're on the throttle, leaving the turn, the, th the shock is making adjustments. This shock functions on the, the 2013, 2012, and 2011 Kawasaki ZX-10R. This is a 2013 version of the bike. You know, a lot of people ask how quickly it thinks. It samples 50 times a second uh, to get the information that it does to make changes to itself. Um, other little things, we did some pre-testing with uh, Scott Russell and Kenny Hill um, up at uh, Thunder Hill who had rave reviews on how it functioned. We took off a shock that they were happy with and put the Metronic on and one of the things that it did, typically when it changes its damping setting in the mid corner, a lot of the mid corner bumps went away. I mean, just disappeared. They felt none of it, so. The MSRP is 1625, which is less than $200 more than a standard TTF shock. The availability is now.